of life. There are passengers and there are drivers. Hello, and congratulations on becoming a 1996 Volkswagen Passat driver. We said we wanted drivers, and here you are, ready to be invigorated and never isolated. I'm Mike Kraft. And I'm Jennifer Thorsby. Oh, and this is Maggie. We're here to tell you more about your new Volkswagen. Your Passat is a result of German engineering at its best, but there's more. At Volkswagen, we don't think in terms of one car, one sale. We believe that once you experience our performance, durability, and handling, you'll be a Volkswagen driver for life. And it's also good to know that you're doing business with a company that cares not only about global sales, but the globe as well. As the fourth largest car company in the world, we strive to preserve our natural resources and promote a healthy environment in all phases of design and manufacturing. Now, one way we help the environment is through recycling. Since 1988, Volkswagen has marked all new plastic parts on its products with their chemical composition. This activity is designed to help simplify future recycling. Now you know a little about us, and we think we know something about you. Research shows you're more educated than the average car buyer. And chances are you've done your homework in selecting Volkswagen. And now you want to know how to get more performance from your Passat than the average car. This video is a good start, but don't stop here. Read your owner's manual and keep your quick reference guide handy for additional information. All three sources will help you get quickly acquainted with your new Passat and understand its unique German driving character. And highlighting features will include the Passat GLS, Passat GLX, and TDI. The features demonstrated may be optional on your model. Let's begin with comfort and convenience. The moment you slip into the driver's seat, you realize this Volkswagen was designed with your driving comfort in mind. If your Passat GLX sedan or wagon has heatable front seats, remember, they can be heated separately at different degrees by rotating the two thumb wheel controls that are located below the radio. Both front seats are adjustable over a wide range. By lifting the handle in front, you can slide the seat forward and backward. The wheel at the base of the seat cushion adjusts the fully reclining seat bag. The smaller wheel adjusts the level of lumbar support. The seat cushion angle is adjusted by this lever. In addition, you can adjust seat height on both driver and front passenger seats. Simply shift your weight forward and pull up on the height adjustment lever until you've reached the desired height. The Passat sedan and wagon have 60-40 split folding rear seats, which provide maximum versatility. Sitting in the driver's seat, you'll find all controls conveniently at your fingertips. The driver and passenger side mirrors can be adjusted electronically. The mirror also automatically defogs when the rear window defogger is on. And as you can see, the exterior mirrors are hinged. They fold when pressed from either direction to help protect them from being broken and easily slip back into position. You'll be glad to know your Passat comes equipped with a height adjustable steering column. The turn signal, headlight dimmer switch, and cruise control are housed on a stalk on the left-hand side of the steering wheel column. There are two cruise control functions on the stalk. The slide control activates the system when it's pushed to the on position. The set button is used to select a cruising speed. You can resume your program speed when you move the slide control to the resume position. The right-hand steering column lever operates the two-speed intermittent windshield wipers with programmable intermittent wipe feature and washers. This feature allows you to set the exact interval desired, up to 22 seconds, to clear the windshield in misty or drizzly conditions. Now, to program, first push the lever from the off position down to the intermittent position. Then, lift the lever to off again. The wipers will clear once. When you want the wipers to clear again, press the stalk down to the intermittent position. You've just set the exact interval you need for your driving condition. By the way, some models also come with heatable windshield washer nozzles. 
When the ignition is on, each nozzle heats up to thaw any ice formed in the washer nozzles during cold temperatures. As you get to know your Volkswagen Passat, you come to appreciate the features which were designed to be convenient to use as well as practical. For example, the Passat GLX sedan and wagon have a multi-function trip computer. You'll find its information display located on the left side of the instrument panel. When the ignition is on, you simply push the button located at the end of the windshield wiper stock to request information. You can access such things as time of day, elapsed driving time, average fuel consumption, distance driven, average speed, oil temperature, and ambient outside temperature. In addition, the multifunction indicator has two memories, one for single trip information and one for cumulative information. Either memory can be zeroed at any time by moving the switch towards zero. If your Volkswagen is equipped with a power glass sunroof, it operates only when the ignition is turned on. By using a single switch, you can open it, close it, and tilt it. Passat's interior lights offer versatility. Passat features a three position dome light. Press the switch to the left for continuous lighting. Set it to the center and it lights up when the doors are open and shuts off when you turn the key in the ignition. Press the switch to the right and the light remains off. If equipped with a power sunroof, the interior lights feature a time delay that will go out about 12 seconds after closing the doors. For added elegance, the driver and front passenger visors have lighted vanity mirrors with covers. Your Passat offers a ventilation, heating, and air conditioning system that keeps you comfortable in all kinds of weather. Airflow enters the car through dashboard and footwell vents. To get maximum floor-directed airflow, close the dashboard vents. The climate control panel is located in the center of the dash. The knob on the left adjusts fan speed. The center knob adjusts temperature. The right knob lets you decide where the airflow goes. Turn it to the far left to turn on your defroster. The air conditioning button is on the next line of controls along with the recirculation button. For maximum cool air recirculation, push the air recirculation button along with the air conditioning button. To use your rear window defogger, Depress this switch to turn it on, and depress it again to turn it off. Your Passat features a premium AM-FM stereo cassette sound system. You can program the radio to store up to 6 AM and 6 FM stations. Programming is simple. Turn to the desired station and press one of the six station buttons until the broadcast is silent. Momentarily, you will hear the desired set station. If you're considering an aftermarket CD changer, be sure to see your Volkswagen dealer for a compatible system. Your radio has been coded to protect against theft. You should have received a radio code card with your code on it. If you didn't, contact your sales professional. If your battery fails or is disconnected, you will need to recode your radio. Just push the seek and reverse scan button at the same time until 1000 appears. Then use the first four station buttons to punch in the number on the card. Push the seek and reverse scan buttons again until the word safe appears. Your radio is now coded and will work again. A blinking red light warns others that your radio is coded and is useless if removed from the car. The light blinks whenever the ignition key is removed. Passant sedan owners will find the trunk release button located under the lid of the lockable console compartment. In the sedan's cavernous trunk, you'll find your spare tire, jack, tools, lug wrench, open-ended wrench, and a screwdriver with a hexagonal opening in the handle for removing wheel bolts. Passat wagon owners will find vehicle tools and the spare wheel located in a recess under the floor covering of the luggage compartment. Volkswagen understands that performance is important to you. It's important to us, too. In fact, performance is engineered into every Volkswagen we build. Simply put, if it says Volkswagen, it's meant to be driven and driven and driven. You'll find out what that means as you spend more time in the driver's seat. But first, it's important for you to understand a few things about your Passat's performance features. Remember to refer to your owner's manual and quick reference guide for additional information. 
If your Passat is equipped with Volkswagen's four-speed automatic transmission, you'll find it truly responsive to your needs. The transmission actually learns how you drive and adjusts its shift pattern accordingly. These patterns range from sport to economy with hundreds of shift points in between. What's more, if another driver operates your car, the transmission will quickly adapt to his or her needs. Every Volkswagen with an automatic transmission is equipped with a safety feature called an automatic shift lock. Your foot must be on the brake pedal with the ignition switch on to shift from park to any gear. One thing your automatic transmission doesn't include is a dipstick, and trust me, it was engineered that way. The transmission requires unique fluid and service, which can only be found at authorized Volkswagen dealers. You'll find a service schedule in your maintenance booklet. Your Passat thrives on unleaded regular gasoline with an octane rating of 87 or higher. If your Passat is a TDI model, you'll of course be using diesel fuel. During cold weather conditions, turn the key to the on position and wait until the glow light goes out before starting the engine. At Volkswagen, your safety and security are top priorities. During the next few minutes, we'll explain some key features. We also suggest you take a moment to review the owner's manual, especially the safe driving hint section. If your Passat is equipped with Volkswagen's anti-lock braking system, or ABS, your braking control is greatly enhanced on wet or slippery road surfaces. The system is designed to help you maintain steering control during sudden braking situations. ABS has an electronic control unit that senses when any of the four wheels begins to skid. Simply push the brake pedal down. Don't pump it. Let ABS work for you. Now you might hear a slight noise and feel a slight pulsation. That's normal. While we take many steps to keep you safe on the road, your best and first line of defense is proper use of your three-point lap shoulder safety belts. Please insist that everyone in the car buckles up when driving. That goes for you, too. And to keep you comfortable as well as safe, all Passat models have driver and front passenger safety belt height adjusters. To operate, press the handle slowly up or down so the shoulder portion of the safety belt is positioned nearly midway over the shoulder. Pull on the shoulder belt to check whether the belt anchor is securely locked in place. For added safety, your Passat is equipped with an airbag supplemental restraint system for the driver and front seat passenger. And when it comes to transporting little ones, extra care has to be taken. Children need specific safety seats designed for their age, height, and weight. In the United States and Canada, the law requires the use of an approved child restraint system for infants and small children. To help secure a child safety seat, your safety belts are equipped with an automatic locking retractor system. Check your owner's manual and child safety seat manufacturer instructions for installation information. Once your precious cargo is in the car, you'll want to keep them there by activating the child safety rear door lock. When the lever is turned to the right, the door can only be opened from the outside. When the lever is turned to the left, the door can be opened by rear seat passengers. Daytime running lights are another standard safety feature on your new Volkswagen. When you start your car, the low beam headlights will automatically come on. While the headlights operate at a reduced voltage to conserve bulb life and battery capacity, they remain bright enough to be seen by other drivers. And that's important. Studies in countries where daytime running lights have been used for a number of years show substantial reductions in multiple vehicle crashes. Keep in mind, daytime running lights are as the name implies, for daytime use only. For nighttime driving, turn the headlight switch to the right for full low beam power. Now let's talk about security. Your car is an investment, and Volkswagen's standard central locking system can help protect it. What can your key do? The answer is plenty. From either front door, you can lock or unlock all doors, the trunk, and fuel filler flap simultaneously. Your vehicle's alarm system is set with a key as well. To centrally lock your Passat, turn the key to the right, the locking position, and hold it. The convenience close feature will sequentially close all windows and sunroof if equipped. The flashing red light on the driver's door sill lets you know the alarm is set. The central locking system also includes a selective unlocking feature. If you wish to unlock a single door, 
turn the key to the left just once. Two turns of the key in rapid succession unlocks all of the doors. Turn the key to the left and hold it in that position for a second or two longer and you can lower all the windows at once. This allows you to cool off your car's interior during hot summer days. This convenience open feature works in either front door. By the way, your power windows have a one touch down feature that allows you to completely open a window with a quick touch of the switch. Passat sedans have locking rear seat backs. The seats are locked with a vehicle master ignition key. You'll find the lock cylinders next to the seat back release levers. When the key is turned in the lock position, a locking lever prevents the seat back from unlatching. As we told you, your key can do many things. You can use your key to open the sedan's trunk or the wagon's luggage area without setting off the alarm. When you close the rear lid or lift gate, the alarm will automatically reset. With the key slot in the horizontal position, the rear lid or lift gate can be locked and unlocked by the central locking system. With the key slot in the vertical position, the rear lid or lift gate remains locked. Besides two master keys, you should have also received a secondary or valet key with your new Passat. It can lock and unlock the doors and start the engine. It's meant to be used as a spare key for a parking lot attendant or anyone who needs access to your car, but not its trunk or lockable console compartment. By the way, the key identification tag that came with your keys provides a number for you to use to replace a lost or misplaced key. Now, it's a good idea to tape the key tag to a sheet of paper and keep it with your other vehicle documents for safekeeping in case you ever need to have a duplicate made. You can also file your radio code with these important documents. As we've demonstrated, your Volkswagen Passat offers a unique and exciting blend of comfort and convenience, performance, safety, and security engineering. Now, we believe so strongly in our product that we have developed a comprehensive protection program for your new Passat. Consult your warranty booklet for details. You'll want to keep in mind that parts and many accessories are available at your Volkswagen dealer, including alloy wheels, keyless entry, CD changer, floor mats, splash guards, fog lights, vehicle care products, and roof carrier bars with attachments for luggage, bicycles, or skis. This video has touched on only some of Passat's unique features. Because we want your driving experience to be a positive one, right from the start, we recommend thoroughly reviewing your owner's manual. It has valuable information every Passat driver should know. We also recommend keeping your quick reference guide handy. It covers essential features about your Passat. If you have a question or concern, we encourage you to discuss it with your sales professional. He or she will make every effort to get you an answer. If the question is still not resolved, then contact Volkswagen Customer Relations Department. Okay, now you're ready to drive the road of life in your new Passat. Have a great trip. passengers and there are drivers.